Marsoc inspired Airsoft Loadout, okay? This isn't a one-on-one -on -one for the Airsoft purists. Uh, some of the stuff didn't come in time, I'm gonna be honest. The American flag didn't come in time, I wanted on there. And I also wanted to put a rise of the magnifier on the Mark 18, so I think that would have looked sick and completed the look. But, you know, you gotta piss the dick that you've got. So we're pissing. <laughs> <laughs> right, okay, so uh, obviously the block tacticals, you know, you know I rant and rave about this brand, guys. Block tactical, get 10% off my code and antenna checkout. They just kick ass, and I don't know if you can see these are the new multicam black um, glasses with the orange tints for depth perception. You can get 10% off using my code and then 10 these things kick ass as a Euro fog. They're just so good. I love them to death. Cry airframe repo lid, and we've got the little tactical torch here, which has a couple of modes. It has the normal white light, then it has red light, and it also has infrared. Pretty cool. Obviously, you've got the clip here for night vision goggles. The mount there. Where did you get the torch from? Yes. Shout out AliExpress, by the way. <laughs> we had a conversation about this, didn't we? AliExpress is the one. I, I think it's good. It's sick. I think, I mean, the, you know, stuff hasn't come for about two weeks yet, but the, the things that you can get that look Gucci for so cheap is perfect for airsoft, so I don't even want to hear it, okay? AliExpress is the go. AliExpress Unity stuff. Yeah. He's legit. And it's, it's um, that, sick. Torch, that torch is on there as well. That torch is only like seven quid, you know? And it looks great. Absolutely. So you can't, you can't complain. I also strobe on the on the back, which you press and it flashes red for when you're wearing nods or you want to say that you're down in the, in the airsoft battlefield. We've got the black beard hat, which I actually got from America, uh, with like a, an M81 multicam setting. And then we've got the new Staylor Move Fast patches, guys, which are now available. Uh, Staylor Move Fast is my little baby my brand I'm trying to grow and you can get these in pretty much any camera there's a drop down menu you can get an M81, DNC, Tiger, whatever you want bro so pretty cool at the moment this one's in black and then we've got some other patches on the rig that I'll show you guys. Right then, Balaclava. I think the scene is starting to grow to these, these are from MB Tactical. The material these, this is made out of is just so good. When I was in America I was wearing a Balaclava and it was really really warm, but with this material you just don't feel like you're overheating Especially when you're playing airsoft, you've got a lot in your head. It's just it's just it just works. It's just great really good and obviously because of the elastic elastic Elasticity. Thank you very much. Yeah, um, it holds this really cool face guard from MB Tactical as well so it presses against your face and molds to your jawline and it's got this smart rubber so when you sweat, it makes the rubber more sticky, so it stays to your face. Pretty cool. That's pretty, pretty, pretty smart. I've, I've literally just brought one. Yeah, that's it. I, I got um, the gator rather than the ballet because yeah. I sweat like crazy. So fair enough, fair enough. <laughs> I thought I'd rock the mechanics, like desert tan styly gloves with this loadout. They're a vibe. They are a vibe. And uh, the reason why I like the fingers cut off, so you've got dexterity, so you can feel your mags. If you go around, it's like an admin pouch at the back, or try to put a mag in. Uh, a dump pouch, you want to be able to feel what you're doing, so I, I never like fully fingered gloves. Brutus the butt, take a look at this! Brutus, this is incredible, what a package! <laughs> oh uh, dear, what are we like? Plate carrier is from Novrich. I always feel like it's, you're gonna get judged when you like use a, a creator's product, right? But it's just so good. It's just, it's just so good. They have custom body armor, air vents aside, which directs all the heat away from your face. It's the lightest plate carrier I've ever owned. They're, so they're really comfy, so yeah, I use it. The unfold pouches are from Warrior, they're elasticated. And what I, what I like about them, people might not know, is they're designed so the mags can only be pulled. Sorry, I've got a bit of a dodgy hand. So the mags can only be pulled towards you. They actually have um, a rubber interior, so if you use on tour and on real ops, because the, these are real seal bits, these M4 pouches here. If someone came up to you and tried to pull a mag towards them away from you, you physically can't because then it, it rubs against the rubber and creates fr friction. So people can't steal your mags. That's a really smart little detail there. Yeah, I, I've got one of them. Those, those front placards from Warrior. Yeah. Love it. It's like one of the best purchases I've made. Yeah? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. I love All it. All right, okay. Um, obviously then we've got a couple of things from Deadly Customs, shout out Deadly Customs. A lot of my little odds and sods or alley little bits are from Deadly Customs because he just does a 
Nice job. So we've got the Quake Tremor holsters on Malice clips from Dead the Customs, as you can see, on both sides. I like to have them primed. I get questions about this a lot in, in my comment section. Like, are they primed good to go? Do they ever go off on DT armpits? The answer is no. You have to throw them from a considerable height to create the impact to initiate the grenades. Is this brownie? It's not really LA. Right. So yeah, so these are from Deadly Customs, but yeah, they, they won't go off under your armpits. I, I do see that in the comments. They won't go off under your armpits. So you can have these ready to go on one, and I have them upside down, so when you pull them out from the holster, you can literally drop it straight towards the ground, so you know, you're deleting time. Got a, a radio pouch here, which doesn't get much use, because I'm notorious for not enjoying running comms. <laughs> But uh, yeah, that's uh, for running comms. New stay up, stay low, move fast, use a garrison patch in multicam black. You can get these in any cam you want at stay low, move fast. Uh, Invictus Morale is the one that actually does it for me. Oh, sure, Brian's got one here. Oh, Chilling, Brian, that's, that's the new one. That's a, that's a Tiger Strike as well. That looks fucking alley, doesn't it? I need me some of that Tiger Strike. I know, so that's what I mean. There's a drop down in the menus. You can get these in any cameras that you want. Yeah, it's smart, that, isn't it? I'm gonna, I'm gonna, Thank you, back to now, ready? Oh, let me talk about this as well. So this is also the RAS system from Deadly Customs. Like, he does these little lots and sods which are ace. So this is the RAS, RAS system. These are Holston Mark Fives. So obviously, you can't you can't launch Quakes over like you're playing baseball because, you know, it's always going to tell the marshals and then you're going to be banned from the site and then you're going to bitch about it on Facebook. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> Just use the RAS system and throw some Mark Fives and you'll be fine. <laughs> Scrap pouch. Oh, yeah, yeah, so then you've got the dangler, the scrap pouch, which I actually don't know what's in here right now. Oh, extra mags, I, extra mags and uh, an airsoft tourniquet. Okay. Um, but I will utilise the scrap pouch for pretty much anything. When I was in America, uh, um, Guardian said... Do you like the, do you like the stance, by the way? It's a, it's a powerful stance. Power, power stance. It's a power stance. Uh, when I was watch out, you don't fall over your thing. When I was in America, I literally just had about twenty uh, M sixty seven grenades in there. How close? Close on the stairs. On the stairs. That's my grenade. So. For when yeah. you gotta go, boom. Yeah, you know when you're on your own. Um, so yeah, there's that. All right, so this is the Dead Customs Rigger Bot. Uh, and the reason why we've got the Akimba holsters is we're going to be doing the Akimba pistol gameplay soon, so we're going to be a big daddy with that. So yeah, Dead Customs, the one. The top and bottom, obviously, M81. I used to get this wrong, I used to pull it DPM and then Brian would get sad at me. Naughty boy. <laughs> <laughs> DPM anyway. is completely different. M M81, um, I've got my Cry Gen 4 knee pads inside these and yeah those are a bit pretty much self-explanatory aren't they and to be honest I've not stopped wearing these boots since I've got them. I do have some Akus but these lowers are just so much more comfier than the Akus at the moment so I've been wearing these everywhere. Lowers and the Gore-Tex as well. Lower Zephyrs is the actual name, Lower Zephyrs. Back paddle is uh, from Warrior Assault Systems. Warrior Assault Systems back panel uh, and this is the helmet, the helmet carrier so you can stick the helmet in here and it's just really good. Obviously when I run HP I'll sit I'll sit the bottle in there. Um What's that? side admin patches that you can put spare little I've got like mini mags in there. You can you get like the mini ones from PCX? Just like you know when like you've gone through all your mags in case these are like the in case, you know? Just in case. What's that alley patch on the back? Oh well I'll play it. I'll play. This is also one of the new Staley Move Fast patches which is now available. Oh shit, look at this. It's cool man, it's cool. It's cool to see my little brainchild come to life and and uh, yeah, Invictus Morale's done a great job with this kind of new design of patches. He does a really good job. So, you gonna put the kit on? Yeah, I'm thinking I'm gonna channel my inner true mobster. Let's do it. Let's do it. Alright, so I thought I'd just break down the Mark 80 for you guys from Firelight Airsoft. This company's from Germany in the fine-tuned Nilsson guns. So, uh, 
the EOTech site, literally a repo one, it cost me like 20 pounds. This is from AliExpress, the absolute goat. We've got the Unity Riser, so I want you to look over my pet box. That's also from AliExpress, guys. It's, it's, it's go to AliExpress is the one, okay? Um, Brain Exploder, pet box, the house, my selfie camera from Runcam. That's how you can see, obviously, the PO, me, uh, POV of me and I'm aiming with the toy gun, etc. Then you've got the scope cam, also from Runcan. And you really don't have to do much focusing with this, it kind of auto focuses itself. Brilliant bit of kit. And the SD cards inside here, these are, I believe, the 64 gigabyte ones. But you can run 128 gigabyte cards on these ones as well. Um, Surefire suppressor and a cheap repo Surefire torch, also from AliExpress. But if you do buy this from uh, Phalanx, it comes with the attachments, it's a one-stop shop. You can literally get all the attachments as you order from Phylax. So, uh, yeah, also the battery, actually not too short battery is in this. It's just a, a VPS of one. It's a Lipo 7.4. Fancy thing, right? Nico, have you seen those ASMRs on like, Instagram and stuff with the Russian girls in the cars? Yes. Yes. Said this. Mark 18. Mercedes. Airsoft. Mercedes. The reason is, I've actually mashed up my right hand a little bit, it's quite weak, so I'm struggling to grip the raft right now. Don't, we, don't worry, I'll be okay in a week or two. The new Deadly Customs High Speed Sling, guys. Uh, this is in multicam black, and you can have it with the pad on or off, and you can have this in uh, over 5,000 colour variations, so that's pretty impressive. Uh, what I like about it is it's very minimalistic, easy to transition to different shoulders, and also as well, I mean, come on, it's Deadly Customs, but where is it? He's probably started to put his brand on things, like these little skulls are now everywhere. I don't know if you can get a close up of that. Um, you can get 10% off using my discount code, NICO10. Link is always in the description of every upload that I do. So, yeah, get the customs. Ooh, okay. <laughs> Rolling. Uh, I just thought I'd show you guys this because it's going to be the, the next video out here. A Kimbo, uh, Kim, a Kimbo, yeah, a Kimbo pistol. But red dot lasers. <laughs> okay, that's achievement unlocked. Happy with that. All right, end of the video.